Hello there, I am Dennis Branval from the Star Wars Battlefront 2 team. In this update, droidicas finally roll out on the battlefront. TX-130 tanks reinforces the Galactic Republic and capital ships station themselves above Naboo in capital supremacy. Also, more appearances arrive to the clone army and Anakin Skywalker. The Separatist Droidica is a dreaded and tough force in battle with its heavy twin blasters and protective energy shield. The Laser Barrage, a burst of menacing, high-rate blaster fire, is an effective way to clear the area of targets. While slow on three legs, the Droidica can transform itself into a wheel and roll rapidly between positions on the battlefront. At the expense of firepower and mobility, the energy shield is a practical tool in a pinch. The TX-130, on the other hand, reinforces the side of the Galactic Republic. This tank can fire rockets individually from each side or unleash multiple missiles at once for devastating impact. Anakin's selection of appearances is now expanded with the General Skywalker appearance, a set of Jedi robes with armor that he wore during the early days of the Clone Wars. The 212th Recon Division and the 41st Scout Battalion are also joining the Clone Army as appearances. That's all for this update, but here's a peek at what we're bringing to Star Wars Battlefront 2 next, including the new planet Felucia, as well as new ways to play the game. More on the way! Thank you for watching, and may the Force be with you.